of Wardy Official. Click here to subscribe. Hi guys, this is Avardi and for today's video, I'm going to share with you how to make Coco Melon inspired outfit. This is useful and best for themed birthday. So get ready and let's start! Rip one side of the skirt using a ripper. But if you don't have it, you can use a cutter. But be careful not to rip your cloth. I'm using my little one's shirt as a pattern. Trace it. For tracing, I just used a white crayon. Pin and add one CMC allowance and cut. Shout out to Salve ET channel for requesting new dress for an old cloth. If you would like to request some DIY craft, let me see in the comment section or in my community tab. I'm glad to read them all. Arrange bodies into its place with right sides together. Sew these sides with the right sides together. For the skirt, measure 12 inches starting from the bottom side of the skirt. Cut this side with one cm seam allowance. So this side. Using elastic thread, sew the skirt and make sure to measure first your kid's waist.
for the waist tie strip, measure 14 inches long and 5 inches wide. But if you want longer strips, you may add more inches. Cut and make two tie strips. Fold the strip facing inside out, then sew one side and leave the other side open. And flip it using a stick. Cut a little portion on the arm side area to make it easy to fold. Start folding the arm side area, pin and sew. Now attach the waist strip inward position with bodies facing inside out. Then pin and sew. For the skirt, attach it into the bodies with the right sides together with 1 cm seam allowance. I have this old fabric trimming and it is good enough to pair it with the skirt. Then attach it and sew at the bottom side of the skirt. For the zipper attachment, at the back side, starting from the center of the neckline, cut 4 inches. Then, cut a cloth strip enough to cover the zipper. Sew one side of the zipper with fabric at the back. This is how it looks like when done, and now ready to attach onto the dress. In and sew.
cut another 1 inch wide same fabric. This will be used for a neckline bias. Pin and sew facing same sides together. Cut the excess zipper, fold a little portion, pin, and sew. Attach trimming fabric and the neckline. This trimming fabric is known as brick wrap. I found this some extra beads and fabric flowers. Then attach it onto the fabric. It's done! Best paired with huge bow or head wrap. Just see on description below for the link. Thank you for watching! Hope you'd enjoy this video. If so, give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. See you next time! Shout out!